You are looking at real human hearts, and these amazing muscular organs pump blood to trillions of cells in your body through an incredible network of blood vessels. And if these blood vessels were stacked end to end, they would stretch about 60,000 miles. That's roughly three times the circumference of the Earth. So clearly this pump, the heart, has quite the important job. So we should probably do our best to take care of it. But what type of exercise is best for the heart? Ideally, we would incorporate both moderate and high intensity cardio into our routines. But today we are going to focus on the higher intensity VO2 max training. And to hit your VO2 max, you pretty much have to be going all out during that bout of exercise. This is influenced by how much oxygen your lungs can bring in, how much your heart and cardiovascular system can deliver to your working skeletal muscles, and even how much of that oxygen those skeletal muscles can extract from the bloodstream and utilize. Now the proper way to set up a VO2 max training session is to do high intensity intervals that last anywhere from three to five minutes. And with whatever you pick, whether it's three minutes, four minutes, or five minutes, you'll want to do four rounds of that with a one to one work to rest ratio. So if you picked four minutes, you'd rest for four minutes and then go into the next round until you completed that four times. And fair warning, this type of exercise can be quite intense and is not for the faint of heart.